Yeah, thank you. Nice to be on. Um, well, I think um, obviously the the bubble or the perceived bubble has probably been propelled by uh, both central bank liquidity uh, and also uh, probably the stay at home trade. So um, we, we've had a lot of stimulus checks. We've had a lot of uh, retail get into the market. Uh, we, we've had a demand for kind of uh, tech stocks, etc. Um, so I, I think if you were looking for something that might reverse it, um, perhaps it's signs that central banks would be less accommodative going forward. Uh, and also we see normalization in, in the economy uh, and people get back to investing in uh, more cyclical sectors. I mean, I, uh, there's been a lot of talk about rotation since November, since the Pfizer uh, vaccine uh, positive news, uh, rotation out of um, tech into cyclicals. But I would argue there's not been a rotation because the tech stocks have still gone up. So what it's been is probably new money gone in more to cyclicals than, than tech. So I suppose the thing that might actually uh, you know, take some of the air out of um, the higher uh, rise in tech area is probably a normalization and a rotation. Well, when it comes to normalization, one of the survey questions that really stood out to me, or survey answers, perhaps a better way to say it, when do you think life will be mostly back to normal in your country? And a third of respondents said by the end of Q3 of this year, but a third said 2022 or beyond. That's a huge difference. When you're speaking to clients and also looking at markets, do these two divergent views manifest themselves in the way people are positioned in the market? Well, it's a bit of a double-edged sword because obviously the longer we are away from normal, the more likely it is that central banks are just going to uh, continue to support the market. Governments are going to continue to uh, fiscally support the market. So it's not clear uh, how you would trade uh, the news if you knew that we weren't going to be back to normal uh, quicker, really, uh, because uh, of all the, the support we've, we've seen from uh, the, the authorities. I think look, our view on, on the return to normal is that the vaccine news is uh, over the last couple of months has been very, very, very positive. Uh, and we do think that life can return uh, to something near normal uh, by the middle of the near year. Now, there will be restrictions, et cetera, of, of some degree. But I think we, I think once we get past Q1, I, I think we might be surprised how quick normality uh, starts to get uh, going. 